Hello everyone, I am Kapil Shah and you are watching Strength Analysis of the Week. So in the Strength Analysis, why we are doing it? Because when the market moves, it is not so that every sector will move in a one period direction or along with the market. Some sector will outlet, some sector will um, mislead or they fall aside. So in the strength analysis, we are just trying to see that in a current context of the market, which sectors are favoring and which sectors are not favoring uh, on the basis of the different different time scales. And then we just try to see that which are the sectors are repeating across the different different time scales. So it helps us to understand that over there, there are some sorts of specific momentum is that. So let's say this is what the strength analysis video that we are producing and uh, this is what the sheet is all about. This sheet is available on the Finland Academy website. So in this particular uh, sheet, we are seeing that okay, the recent fall that has been starting from the 1st December when the market was in 8800 level till our last Friday. We composed this data on the week on week basis. So market is down by the 5 percentage. So in that period 5 uh, percentage down, these are the sectors which has shown certain kind of the outperforms like the metal, financial services, oil and gas, fertilizers. They did well whereas on the other side, textile, media, consumer services, IT, services stock has underperformed. So this is what my recent fall. This data of the one and a half year, this is what shows the outperformance across the one and a half year. Then the previous week, that is what the 9th uh, Jan to 13th Jan, these are the sectors uh, more of four weeks average, previous month, previous three months average, uh, top five, bottom five sectors that we have compiled. So now let's say uh, here financial, let's say for example, we talk about the financial service sector. So financial service sector is quite wide actually. I think there will be near about by 80 stocks under it to that. And it has in a different, different segmentations like the PSU banks, uh, insurance, housing finance companies, exchanges, various kinds of things are there. So how to understand that in the financial services stocks, what is moving and what is not moving. So here we understand that what the subsectors are moving. So let's say for example, I have did the detailing on the uh, subsector sites. So this is the subsectors of the financial services. So when we understand that when the market is down by 5 percentage, all overall sectors has comparably did well. So that's why it is coming under the so let's say for example non-insurance and reissues are the stocks which is doing quite well financial term lending stocks are there which is also doing well uh, they are kind of oriented towards you know power sector financing and uh, there afterwards you see the outstanding performance from the pc banks or uh, housing banks so then you understand that okay fine these are the sectors are moving up mutual funds are not doing that much well exchanges are not doing that much well services and financial investments Financial investment is in a major chunk, which is not doing that much well. So we understand this that key of which sector is moving and which sector is not moving from a subsector perspective as well. So we can pay our attention on those particular stocks. Ki kaha pe kya kaise momentum aa rahi hai. So in this particular week, we are seeing that key financial stocks is the one which is uh, recurring quite well. There are the metal stocks are the one which has a good amount of recurrence. Oil and gas is the sector which is doing quite well. So these are the performing sectors we can say. Whereas on the bottom five sides, we are seeing uh, textile is the one sector. Consumer services is the another sectors where there is a huge amount of the underperformance are there. So this particular uh, note help us to understand that where we buy opportunities and where we sell opportunities. So this is what the strength analysis video. Thank you so much and see you in our next video and we expect you to subscribe this channel. Thank you so much.